hello people in the last lecture we have completed the bashing of bjt we learned how to keep bjt in active region why should be bjt in active region because for bjt to amplify a signal it should be in active region only in active region it can amplify a signal this is the main thing we are keeping the bjt in active region next if we talk about amplifying a signal if we consider a normal transformer if we provide 10 volt input to the transformer let me take step up transformer it can change that 10 volt into 100 volt so the transformer is also amplifying the signal why to use pjt for suppose i am using bjt i am giving a input of 10 volt i am i am amplifying it to 100 volt if you observe clearly guys these two are performing the same action then what is the difference between transformer and bjt we can use bjt instead of transformer or we can use transformer instead of bjt why are we manufacturing two devices the reason is if you observe in transformer voltage is increasing but if the current here is 10 ampere it will become 1 ampere here with the increase of voltage the same amount of current is decreasing indirectly i can tell that in transformer power is constant it is just transforming the power the power remains constant in transformer while coming to an amplifier if i am applying an input voltage let me say it is increasing to 10 times in transformer the if voltage increases current will decrease decrease but while coming to amplifier if voltage increases current will also increase if this is the input current output current will be greater than input current so indirectly i can tell that if i consider power input it is vi into ii if i consider power output it is 10 vi into some i not is more than ii let me take 2i not 2ii i not is 2yi so it is 20 vi ii in amplifier power is not constant it is amplifying the power also in transformer power is constant but in amplifier it is amplifying the power also if someone asks you that amplifier voltage is increasing so parallelly current should decrease that is a wrong concept guys in amplifier voltage may increase or decrease but current will also increase because if you see current gain it will be beta alpha and gamma beta will be greater than 1 gamma will be greater than 1 and alpha will be nearly equal to 1 so amplifier amplifies power but generally we will tell that voltage level is increased it will increase as the power level now you may get a doubt how come output power is greater than input power is amplifier creating a new power inside it it's a logical question guys if i am giving a 10 watt of power how come output output will be 100 watt it should be 10 watt it, it should be less than 10 watt if you consider losses just as in transformer but here i am telling that amplifier is giving high power output when compared to input so from where it is getting extra power if you observe guys to keep amplifier in active region we are giving a dc supply to the amplifier do you remember this so what will amplifier do is it will take the power from dc supply what is provide this what is providing dc supply it is nothing but biasing what is biasing providing vce and ic so indirectly we are providing some dc power to the amplifier this amplifier take this input power it will take this dc power and it will increase the input power level and it will give it to the output this is the basic difference between amplifier and transformer amplifier increases the power level while transformer keeps the power as constant in both cases voltage is increased 
in amplifier current level will also increase but in transformer according to the voltage current level will change if voltage increases current decreases if voltage decreases current increases so power remain constant but here power will increase this is the most important interview question guys so learn carefully thank you if you like my explanation do subscribe to my channel that's it